Okay, just cleaning the screen there. Um, hope everybody's doing okay. Now I get lots of comments asking me to make certain videos. So what I do is I just thought I'd let you know about my plan of the next videos I'm going to be making over the next couple of months to support you. So uh, just in my office at the moment, it's freezing cold outside. Um, and actually, uh, although you might often see a big white background with me in there, behind the scenes, it's a bit more messy. So I've got my Gratinol shelving there. So thanks to Gratinol for providing some of that. I've got my soundproofing. I've got my new uh, kind of 64 gig RAM kind of uh, desktop there, which helps with the live streams. And I'm actually filming this just on an old uh, camcorder. So normally I've got a digital camera there, which kind of uh, looks down at the table. And then I'm presenting to another camera just in front of me. So on the table, uh, I've actually got this from uh, Beach and Cliff School. Uh, this is to look at equilibrium, uh, where you have maybe three forces acting at different angles. Uh, so I'm going to be working on that soon. I've also got this thing here from the Royal Academy of Engineering. They uh, sent it out. This is like an advanced copy, and it's all about engineering in a pandemic. And then this morning, this arrived. So this one here is from a company called uh, Mindsets. Um, actually, I might just have a look inside it now. And inside there's some equipment. Um, I think actually in here there's like a fan, there's like a, a motor, some plastic moulding stuff. And this is basically for a kit that can be sent out to students if they're working at home at the moment or in schools. And it's all free from the Royal Academy of Engineering. Um, and it's to help uh, people, especially at Key Stage 3, look at how engineering is actually solving this current crisis. So I'm going to make some videos for that uh, quite soon. Down here, uh, I'm actually working on some ideas to go in my shop. So I've got some Lego bricks here. I think this might well be my GCSE set of Lego bricks. Uh, so we've got our kind of um, uh, kind of just general particles here. We've got some electrons, protons and neutrons, uh, which is what you basically need to know about at GCSE. And I'm just now working on my list of what might be needed for the A-level booster set and so on. So um, let me know in the comments if that might be of interest to you. I also got today, so it's really exciting that all these parcels have arrived. Um, I've got these rulers here. Now, these ones here um, are line of best fit rulers that some of you have seen in the video. Now, I contacted the guy who made these. Uh, he said that this is all he's got left. So I think there's about 20 here. I'm going to be giving those away to a school and some students when I do my 100k giveaway in a few months. And actually, these were made by uh, this guy here, Miles Hudson. He's actually written this book. If anybody um, does Edexcel International A level, uh, it's a good book I've been using and I'm actually making some more videos. I'll talk about that in a sec. Uh, yeah, bits and pieces here. I've got a load of Lego cats. They've just arrived. Um, I'm going to be making a video about cathode rays and there's going to be some cats involved just to try and liven this up a bit. And then this arrived today. So uh, normally, actually, I've, I've got a couple of T-shirts I wear and I tend to wear them. don't really wash them because it's just me in the office. They, they don't really get washed. But I've got this one over here. So I've got a physics online. Uh, this one is in orange, and that's to do with some videos I've got planned for the summer. I've also got, this is the first time I've seen them, I've got a white one. I might need to iron that. So I've got physics online and a subtle uh, light grey on that. Um, and then the other one I got, just to have a look. Wow, there's a lot of static there. It's like uh, John Travoltage. Um, we've got Physics Online, this one here, again in like a dark grey on the black. Now I'm not really planning to do t-shirts, but these are for me to wear in videos and I'll probably wear this one for GCSE live streams because it's black, and this one for the A-level live streams because it's white. Anyway, there's just uh, bits and pieces around here, but this is my video plan that I'm kind of working towards at the moment, so I thought I'd show you the videos I'm going to be doing. Now, I've got ones here. Uh, which are for GCSE. Now, pretty much AQA I've covered 100% uh, every possible combination of videos that you might need. But when I actually looked at different topics for other exam boards, including those of you in Northern Ireland, uh, people in Wales and also people internationally, you can see there's some subjects I've missed out. So things like uh, rectifiers, relays, digital electronics, earth wires, um, Brownian motion. So some of these you might know about from A-level, but at GCSE, I haven't made videos yet, so that's my kind of to-do list for GCSE, so I can completely cover every possible aspect of it. Um, A-level, I've got various things I'm doing, so let's start up here. 
So um, I'm going to be doing some of these revision videos. Uh, so you've seen them for like maybe AQA, all of electronics. I'm going to be doing that for all of the AQA topics. Uh, so the kind of particles and radiation. I had a mistake in the video that I made last year, so I've taken that down. But medical physics, engineering physics, turning points, all of these options as well. I'm going to make some basically 20 minute, half hour long summaries of those. I'm going to be doing the same for OCRA as well. Um, and then I've got a few other things that I'm going to be doing. So these ones here are like kind of teaching from scratch rather than revision. So a video about cathode rays, um, wave particle duality, like a summary, electron microscopes. So that's both scanning and tunneling electron microscopes. Uh, and then a bit more about relativity. So that's to help support those of you doing this AQA thing. Uh, and these are going to be like on my website. I also have um, similar things. So I'm going to be doing some summary videos to support Edexcel International A-Level. Uh, so that's basically these ones here, and it's these three ones here I'll be doing first. So electric circuits I'm working on now, and then I'll be doing waves, and then the kind of all the stuff at AS level quite soon. Also, um, to support Edexcel International A level, uh, I've made quite a few example questions, but I'm going to be doing some uh, other questions from different years. So uh, these are kind of some year 13 worked examples. Now, although they're based on an Edexcel International A level, old specification past paper, they're going to be sorted out by topic, so no matter which uh, topic or which exam board you're studying for A-level physics, these will be useful. Okay, and I'll put a link beneath this video to the ones I did for AS level. And the reason I'm doing this stuff at Edexcel International A-level is because it's also being used by Harrow School Online uh, and as part of their course. So I'll be doing those kind of A-level videos soon, as well as some past papers. So um, I'm going to be concentrating in past papers on AQA, uh, followed by OCRA, followed by Edexcel. Uh, and at the moment, the only ones that should be released to the public are from 2018 and 2017. So the 2019, at this time, as far as I know, aren't available. So what I'm going to be doing is uh, paper one, two, and uh, three. And that's pretty much the same for both Edexcel and AQA. Um, I might just do 3A. I haven't decided how much time it's going to take to do all the options this year. I will be doing them in the future. And again, for OCRA, I'll be doing the modelling, exploring and unified. Uh, you might know as well, that I've already done some AS papers, uh, including for breadth and depth and AS1 and AS2. I've got an Edexcel one to finish off there. So I will be doing some past papers. That's the plan. So this is kind of like what I'm working towards. But the thing is, as soon as I get through stuff, there are more things which are going to be added. So although that's my kind of plan to do for GCSE, I'll do as much as I can of the main topics first of all, and I want to really just concentrate on A-level because I think GCSE is pretty much, I'd say, 98% complete on the website, but I know I've got more stuff to do for A-level. Um, anyway, basically, that's what I get up to. I'm kind of sat here on my own. I've been doing this for about two and a half years, uh, kind of sat here making videos, and actually it's your support which is really vital. The fact that I've had people like you guys buying some of the pin badges. Um, I've got a couple here, I think, so... For some of you who have been buying pin badges, that helps support me. If you're signing up for GCSE or A-level as an individual, or your schools are, that's allowing me to spend the time to make more videos. And ultimately, as the years go on, I'm just going to be adding more and more and more until I dominate physics and I've got every possible past paper that you might need to help support you uh, to get the highest grades, to be a bit more confident when you have any exams or assessments. But yeah, um, in the descriptions below, please let me know which videos you want me to be doing first, other videos I could be making, topics that you don't quite understand that you'd like me to support you with, and it will get added to the list. You might see, if you look back at my YouTube channel over the last year, all the videos that I have made, and there's a lot more on the website which you don't see on YouTube. So have a look, and uh, yeah, let me know in the comments below which videos I should be making first, other things to add to my list, because I basically, I'm doing it for you guys, uh, and I want to say, guys, that's all the boys and girls and everybody out there around the world who's doing some form of physics. But let me know, because I want to make stuff that you lot will find useful. Thank you very much, and uh, goodbye.